Hi guys, sorry for lack of content. Um, I had a back spasm last week, so I was out for the whole week. Two days I was stuck in bed, so I couldn't really do much working on the van. So we're in my living room. Uh, I haven't done anything new with the van, so I'm gonna show you something else I've been chipping away at in my living room. Yes, my living room, it's been raining a lot, and I know uh, some people don't do this because their partners would complain about it. Mine doesn't live with me, so I do what I want. And I can say that because she doesn't watch my videos either. <laughs> um, so, again, hi Ian, hi Ryan. What we're going to do now is I'm just going to show you quickly what I've been working on. Now, this is not pretty by any ends of the means. I know this already. Let me explain. There's the top. Right, so basically the countertop here um that was uh free uh, as a broken table at work so i was given that that's a cupboard that's purple again it was broken uh broken um so I, I put that on there i'll show you how i did that painted it up a little bit just to see if the uh, paint would stick um everything else here is from the original build so i didn't spend any money on this so let me just show you quickly. Uh, the missus, oh actually, yeah, let me let me wind back a little bit here. So we put this in my van, in the van, and my missus wanted more bedroom. So then I had to cut into the cupboard uh, a space so the mattress can push up against this. That's where the end of the bed is. So then I had to rearrange all this and redo that. So that's the first thing she wanted. And then I'll show you another one. Then she didn't want any catches uh, on this. So I went and I got a couple of catches. They didn't work, but these magnetic ones did. So that's what I'm using now. I got two there, one on top, one on the bottom. Then she said she wanted a shelf. So I put a shelf in there. So this one could be either my clean water or my wastewater. And then I have another tank on the side in there. Um, here, I'm gonna put a uh, little storage unit. It's like a, a double shelf from Timu. So I could put little bits and bobs in here. And then once we not, well, once I know what we're putting in here, I can, you know, put edges on it so it doesn't roll off and stuff. But I don't know what she wants to put in there yet. But um, that's all done. It needs a sanding. Um, I did buy a sander and a screw gun from Wix and I bought Wix own brand. So hopefully that's okay. But um, I'm just going to give it a bash with the new sander and see how it comes out. Then repaint it and then hopefully I can put it in the van and get it out of the way. Because then I have to work on the fridge area here. All right, for a first time pass over here, that's not too bad. And there's not a lot of dust either. I didn't clean anything up. So I think that uh, dust bag might have caught some of it. I was a bit skeptical about that, but. So a bit of filler, a bit of paint. I'm gonna do some touch-ups, but um, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pull it off the table this side so I can do the front bit. Um, and then, uh, yeah, just spot sanding by hand. All right, so this is the end product here. Yes, as you can see, I got rid of some of the holes, some of the screw marks, some of the drips that were on there. Um, did this side as well. It's still wet at the moment. This I would have to do another coat, but at the moment it's fine because this isn't the final color. I did around there. So, yeah, I'm happy with that. I'm not sure if I mentioned it, but inside there is all that foil that I used from uh, the van. Um, the reflective stuff just to seal this up so it's a bit more airtight. That's where the gas is. But um, yeah, happy with that. Let me know anything in the comment section, guys. Next time you see it, we'll hopefully be in the van and uh, all set up.